Hello, Gemini. So I'm about to do a reading for you guys. It's showing me depression. Um, possibly been upset about something. Could be secrets. Could be children involved. Um, I feel like somebody's hiding something here. Um, somebody's just waiting for the swords to drop kind of feeling. Okay. There is a completion that is about to occur and there could be an element of trying to grasp at the last straws of what's left kind of thing. Someone possibly being a little um, overly dramatic, even acting, and someone being very deceitful trying to make out with what they can as they leave. And as they do so, it leaves the other person having to make a choice, okay? You may be reaching out to this person or trying to reach out to this person. They may, may seem like they're just too far away for you to... Um, provide a new beginning to, okay? You may not see a way to expand with them. You may be wanting to, but it's just, you know, not really happening. They may be busy doing other things, you know, but somebody needs truth and clarity in this situation before they can move on and have a new beginning, okay? So, um, we have, sorry, we have the Page of Cups and the Ace of Cups. So I feel like there's a water sign, could be Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer, who feels an emotional connection to you, right? And they have offered you love. They have offered you a new beginning. But maybe you feel like it's a pipe dream. I don't know. Something like that. I notice that I don't understand why, but for some reason I'm drawn to the rainbow for this. So this person could be, um, it could be a same sex relationship or because she's at the end of the rainbow, you could see this person as a treasure, you know, not to be cheesy, but I mean, that's, you know, something that I see here, but there's something about this fish in the cup that makes me feel like you're not really taking this offer seriously. And this new beginning is with someone from your past, possibly a soulmate. Um, it could even be a child, but there's an element here of juggling and that could be why the relationship cannot move forward or is not moving forward. Because I see the two of cups. So it's like the two of you you do have a connection. You both acknowledge the connection or it appears that you do. But one of you is more reserved and one of you is more um, flamboyant, I guess is the word I would use. You guys may have come together in a way that helped to heal both of you in some way. But things are changing and it looks like the wheel is turning. And when the wheel turns, it can be in your favor or not. I've heard people say it's coming in your favor. It, not necessarily. Um, not all decks does it mean that. But regardless, the wheel is turning because the juggling, because of the indecision, um, I feel like you or your partner may receive a proposition or offer from an earth sign, or it could just be someone coming in, giving an offer, actually expending that energy and choosing to spend the time, money, and effort it takes to move forward in a relationship with this person. Okay. And I feel like the person 
doesn't want to move away, but they see that they've been in a third party situation with you or you with them. And somebody in this situation is only seeing a third party. They're not seeing love, like actual love. But somebody here is still holding on. So it's kind of like I'm walking away, but I want you to see me walking away so that you'll stop me. But nobody really stops them, whether that's you or the other person. Okay. It's not that you don't want to. But someone here just doesn't, uh, can't put the effort in or is not willing to put the effort in because they're clinging to a third party situation. They don't want to um, change anything. They want to keep everything the same and hold on to everything the same way that it's always been. And this is going to bring about some heartbreak here. Um, but I definitely see like this person... They're wanting a passionate new beginning, and it's probably with you, but they're seeing that that's not going to happen. So their defenses may be up, and they're entertaining the thought of this new offer, okay? Again, we've got Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer with these cups. So this could um, talk about emotional, an emotional person or your emotions. Um, offering emotions. Somebody here is being more um, level-headed, strong, taking control. And again, it's showing the water sign. So I'm, I could be wrong here, but I'm thinking the water sign is kind of standing in their power going, you know, I've, I've looked at this situation and it's not working out for me and I'm not happy about it. I've offered you love and you've offered me, mm, yeah, <laughs> you see what I'm saying? And so this person is striking out um, on their own, trying to be more confident, trying to be more passionate in finding something with more balance, something more just. And um, I feel like the same person, like they would jump at the chance at a higher commitment with you, but they're not getting it, right? And so they have um, made a judgment call and decided to walk away and to end the situation. So there's like turbulence here. This is um, shaking the world, you know? And like I said, they're moving forward um, alone, looking for their happily ever after. Yeah, there's a lot of element of self-love here. And again, here's that earth sign again. So this definitely this definitely could be you or the other person, but I feel like it's the other person. And I see you here, and I think you're contemplating on the stability in the relationship that you had, and you may bring forth some drama here. It's weird because you were offered love, but you didn't want it. Yeah, your intuition knew that this was the person for you, but you were chained to a situation that was not good for you. And so someone here is deciding to build and create possibly with an earth sign, like I said, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, and to end the battles. All right, guys, I hope to see you again soon. You have a good day. Bye.